Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from Last Stand Gamers, and welcome to episode 23 of Space Engineers. So something very interesting has happened in this recent patch. Yes, I am in the armory, and the weapons are now activated. So it's only the assault rifle at the current moment in time, and with the patch, something else very interestingly happened. So I'm going to drop down here. We are now in the shooting gallery. Okay, so basically let's have a quick look at this assault rifle and how it responds. So you've got this sort of drilling noise when you aim down the sights. The sound of it is pretty satisfying. Sounds pretty good. Um, the aesthetics on the right hand side of the screen, it feels a little bit stiff, but you know, it's not really a shooting game, it's more about building. But let's have a quick look on what it can do. So I've built these targets and this sort of target range just to try stuff out, so let's have a go. Right, there we go. So there's no reload yet for this thing, but it is extremely cool to use. So let's have another go, shall we? Let's try shooting at some of this armor next to the target. So, so these are like bullet. These are bulletproof. These little targets. Obviously, these are called cover, and they bulletproof to stop the rounds. You can tell the different noises when something hits. So you can see that's denting. That's denting. So everything except these covers and some of the other items can actually be damaged. So let's take another shot at some of these targets. Right, there we go again. So you can see how cool that works. You're probably wondering why these targets are popping back up like they are. Well, this works on a very interesting system. That one at the back's not popping up, so maybe I've broken it. Let's just check. So, to get these targets operational, we need to turn them on. Then we get out. That rear target should be popping up, but it's not for some reason. So, we'll have to get back in and turn it off. Oh, I know what's going on here. That's fine. So, these are all on, on, on. Hang on. That one's off. That one must be the problem. Right, so basically, these are simple pop-up targets using the new mechanic... That is, you've got some settings to actually control your motor now. So it works rather interestingly. I'll show you what happens. So by simply activating your inventory, well, not your inventory, by pressing K, you get in your motor settings. So we've got the motor set to a certain way. So I'll quickly explain the features. So the torque is basically the strength of motor and how fast it'll accelerate when it's turned on. The braking is when it's turned off. Um, what will the strength be basically applied to it to move it and how much force will it hold so say you wanted to a ship to enter it then what you'd have to do is shift it to a higher so nothing like a bullet could knock your gate down velocity is when basically when it accelerates until a certain give thing so you don't want a really high velocity because your door will go too fast and snap off the same with torque you don't want it to go too fast or it'll snap off but with torque it can only accelerate as much as the velocity will allow it to go to its maximum ro uh, rotations per minute so lower limit and upper limit basically these are uh, degrees on imagine a circle and this is how far it'll turn so mine is set to 0 to 92 degrees so we'll actually have a look behind the target to show you how these work and show you a bit of detailing on them so to actually show you how these work we can actually have a look down here I'll get rid of this assault rifle and I'll get rid of this hood for us so we just need to get rid of that and if we ta simply take a look down here you can see the degrees on the actual rotor so whatever you set and program in there if it's on a minus it's going to go around the opposite way than if it goes on a positive also if you're having problems with these rotating what you need to do is also have the motor on the opposite side so firstly when I was actually trying this out this was broken so what would happen is I had it on this side and this would push forward and it wouldn't allow me to push back but we'll get back in and we'll turn them on and we can see if we can actually pop these back up for a final time sometimes they don't pop up if they're damaged so I've turned them on and we've got two targets popping back up beautifully the third one yes and there we go so we've made ourselves a little target range in the basement of the asteroid so the new assault rifle is very nice the sound of course is because you can hear the vibrations going through the suit um, and I can't really say too much more about it it's really damaging it damages little ships it doesn't do too much damage to the big ships but it is a very nice little introduction and I can't wait to see what else they have to offer on the weapons front so hopefully I inspired you for some creations and I'll see you next time.